Hi, and welcome to Music Moves. My name is Alexander Jensenius. And I'm Hans Seiner Henriksen. And I'm Christian Limon. And now we are sitting here at the Department of Musicology at the University of Oslo. And we are interested in music related body motion. And the question that we want to answer is why does music make us move? But then, Hans, I would like to ask you, does music make us move? Well, if I shall answer for myself, I will definitely say yes. I experience that I move a lot to music when I hear music. But I'm not sure if it's like that for, for everybody. And I'm not sure what in the music is most important for that. What do you think, Christian? I would say it's a complicated question, but uh, especially the rhythm and the way the music is communicated through emotion, that's very important parts, at least, of how music makes you move. Mm. So, what exactly are we going to, to talk about then in, in this course? Well, we are going to talk about uh, specific concepts, the entrainment process, for example, what makes me nod my head. Mm -hmm. Terminology, such as the difference between motion and action and gesture. Mm -hmm. And we are going to talk about the history, why we have arrived at the situation we have today, for example. Mm. Technologies for studying music-related body motion. Mm. So, as you see, you're going to learn a lot about different types of theoretical approaches to this, methods to use, and of course also some of the research uh, that we are uh, producing um, uh, when we study music-related body motion at uh, the University of Oslo. Welcome to Music Moves.